SDS, SDS Plus, SDS Max. All these different types of drill bits. What do they all mean? Seems like every day we're getting into discussions about hammer drills because obviously we're drilling holes into concrete to install the Rapid RH sensors. But there are really differences in the types of hammer drills that are out there. Now one, you have standard drills that have hammering capability to them. Unfortunately, when you're trying to drill into the concrete, they're not really designed for that. And the big reason comes down to how the drill bit is chucked up inside of the drill. So with a standard drill like this, you put the drill inside of it and the shank of the drill is round. And what happens is as you turn the chuck, the chuck has three jaws that tighten up around that uh, round shank. The problem with that is you can never really tighten it enough to where if you're drilling into the concrete, if you hit a piece of aggregate, you're going to ensure that that drill bit's not going to just turn inside of the drill itself. So that's where the SDS, the SDS Plus, and the SDS Max come into play. So what's the difference? Well, when you look at an SDS Plus, that was, or an SDS, the SDS was the original type of drill bit that was designed. And SDS stands for Slotted Drive System. As that became more popular, the SDS Plus came out to take the place of the SDS. And when you look at that, what it looks like as far as the shank goes is it is still round, but at the very end it becomes square and has slots so that when you take it and put it into a drill like this, which is an SDS hammer drill, all you have to do instead of having it tighten up on it is just put it in there and it stays put. And as you can see, you have that very drastic hammering mechanism so that when you're drilling the hole, you're insured to get all the way through the concrete. The great thing about having that square capability and the slotting is the fact that you don't have the ability for that, that drill bit to twist inside of the drill itself. When you look at the difference between the SDS Plus and the SDS Max, what it really comes down to is the capability of that um, that drill or that drill bit. The drill bit just has one additional little flange in that in the very end of it. Again, it helps to keep it tightened even that much more when you're doing those bigger diameter holes. One of the things I hear people talk about is they talk about, well, I'm gonna go out and I just found a drill that says inch and five sixteenths SDS hammer drill. And they think that inch and five sixteenths has something to do with the diameter of the shank that the, the drill will accept. And it's not. That first number in front of the hammer drill when you're out there uh, shopping for the differences really comes down to that's the recommended maximum diameter of hole that they would recommend you drill with, a, uh, with that specific hammer drill. So again, if you're drilling Rapid RH sensors into the concrete or doing any kind of drilling in the concrete, an SDS hammer drill is the only way to ensure that you're gonna get the job done correctly. Now, I just showed you the Bosch Bulldog hammer drill with our Hilti vacuum attachment on there. My question to you, what kind of hammer drill do you use? Let us know on our Wagner Meters Facebook page.